Hi, I'm Jim Ferguson with Before the Movie. Follow me to Hollywood as I interview the biggest stars and filmmakers exclusively on The Ferguson Files. Join Jim as he interviews the star of The Crown, Gillian Anderson. I want to congratulate you for your performance as Margaret Thatcher. It was just outstanding. I was just thinking, was it about a year ago today almost that you were offered this role? And uh, how did you feel about that? It was both surprising, but also, I guess, flattering in a way. Um, and um, you know, one of those roles that you, you some part of you knows that you can't say no to if you feel like it uh, might reside inside you in some way or form. Uh, how would you describe Margaret Thatcher's relationship with the Queen? Complicated. Um, that they there were certainly uh, a lot of very striking similarities, but there were a lot of differences between them. And I think that uh, from what I understand, from what I've read, that it was, um, you know, it was at times fractured. And um, I, I can understand why, given their particular roles and um, and how they were brought up and how they attacked problems, or in the Queen's case, didn't attack problems, um, how that would sit um uh differently with them and might become frustrating dealing with somebody um either seemingly inactive or somebody too active seeing the waste like the games where they're throwing logs and all this stuff that they're doing did she yeah. see that as a, a a waste of money I, i'm sure she saw it as a waste of everything but um um, and and uh, a lot of silliness for, for no particular reason. But I think more than anything, she was really distracted at that time with what was going on, you know, back home in the UK and, and where her um, time could have been best served, but also what was going on in terms of her cabinet and feeling like, you know, while she was away that they were speaking out against her um uh you know which felt like a certain betrayal and so i think she felt like um she really needed to to focus on more important things than throwing cheese yeah i'm almost out of time but she was dealing with a couple of things very serious to her one was her missing son a uh, mark uh and then also what was going on in the falkland islands both at the same time so there's sort of the same time there's a little bit of overlap i think there's a bit of creative license that was taken there um uh certainly i think maybe the mark disappearance happened a bit before the first rumblings of of the falklands but yes yeah, i mean she yes she, she had a, a lot on her plate at different times well, it's a wonderful series, and you are outstanding as Margaret Thatcher, and I want to again congratulate you, and I can't wait to watch this again. Thank you so much. Thank you.